to start with, I am here to share some points to make your learning of electronics subject easier. With 18 years of experience in teaching electronics to about 2000 and more students, I have come across some problems which students face in studying electronics. First of all, the fear which arises in every student with electronics being a complex subject. Let it be a electronic engineering student or an ENTC or a computer science student. Well, the hassle, every one of us know electrons, which is a negatively charged particles from where we frame the name electronics. It is a merger of physics and maths, not necessary to be very good at maths. Moreover, a few understandings in electronics is must for beginners. The joke is whether electronics and electricals the same? No, they are not. The first difference lies in Electronics deals with semiconductor materials, a tetravalent atom. Example, silicon and germanium works as a conductor above room temperature and insulator at 0 degrees Celsius. It refers to LEDs, integrated circuits and digital devices. Electricals deals with conductors made up of aluminium or copper, melts at a high temperature, refers to flow of energy in devices, motors, generators, electrodynamics. As semiconductors are involved in electronic devices, it operates at low voltage 5 volt to 12 volt direct current whereas electrical circuits operates on 230 volts alternating current as in the home supply and above 11,000 volts in high power application as in railway lines. It also operates on DC at times. The third point to be covered is in today's highly digitized world where we use number of electronic gadgets, remote control devices, working with high speed such as control device or decision making device. As we see AI boom due to computing devices. This is with electronics. On the other hand, as electricals is concerned, like high tension wires do not have decision making capacity. Most modern appliances work on both electricals and electronic circuits. I hope with this point, a basic idea of an electronics is clarified and here I end with my session.